I just got to click the button on and friggin' come at it. Because, whoa. You know, I, man, where are we supposed to be in the computer age, in the 21st century? You know, where's my future? You know, that would be a series. Where's my future? You know, I, wow. Society, technologically wise, is stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. You know, I'm no genius. I know that. But wow. Get this, peeps. I'm talking. I get a phone call. All right? And I'm like, and there's this voice talks before the answering machine clicks on. I guess they can't hear the message or something. My answering machine's old. I don't know what the frack. Right? I hear this. Timothy? Timothy? And I'm like, oh, shit. You know, and then it clicks off before the answering machine starts. No one leaves a message. Some yuts friggin' won't leave a message. Oh, no, that's bad. I just know that's bad. Shit's gonna happen. You could just be, I know it's magical thinking. Uh, how could anybody be psychic? It's not possible. I believe in naturalism. There is no supernatural. But still. <coughs> I'm in good health. Ah, I'm winning. But still, I know some shit's going to happen. Oh, yeah. You just know it when your spinster goes, shit's going to go down. Yeah. So, on to the story. Okay. Phone rings again, and I, and I swear to God, you know, the invisible sky daddy that ain't there, you just can tell when the phone rings, it means something. You know, it rang again. I'm like, okay. Son of a bitch, here it comes. Here it comes. Just fucking know it. Psychic waves are shooting out. Ding, ding, ding. My spidey sense is going off. Shit's going to get real. I pick up the phone. Hello? No, I don't pick up the phone like that. I mean, I pick up the phone. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Yeah, no, not me. Person answering it. She goes, Hi. You know, I'm like, okay. Hi. She goes, Are you taking... Vuska Moska Kiska Dick Cream? I'm like, oh, uh, hello, he says. And she goes, well, um, we're trying to find out about your doctor. This is Tim McKnight, right? Can I have your number? Can I have your, what the hell she asked? Oh, the only answer is for your birth date now. All right, January 30, 1967, you know, I'm an old gray fuck, right? You know. And it's just like, well, we just wanted to find out if you've been taking this or not. And I go, oh, it's a long story. I am doing it. I'm going to pick it up my next prescription. And she goes, oh, okay. Uh, I go, uh, is, is that what this is about? You know, I'll just get it from South Sacramento Real Pharmacy, you know. She goes, Here's where it gets real, right? You know. <clears throat> she goes, Oh, this is CVS Pharmacy. It's the one we've been the one they've been building for like three years. They swore to not impact anybody from South Sacramento Leader Pharmacy just down the street. It she goes, uh, they're clever. They're closed. They're closed? Oh, yeah. All your prescriptions are here. 
Okay. I guess that's all right. So, um, okay. Well, um, all right then. You could just deliver them next time. How much is your delivery fee? Hope you don't deliver. Oh, great. So, you get a block away because I can't walk or be hassle to get a ride. You know, uh, I got to find out how to get a ride there. And if I take fair transit, you know, oh, you know, you, your little fatty ass can't get shuffled and bring it down the block. You know, maybe you should walk, fat ass. But no, it would cost me $5 each way. You know. So, that's happening. She goes, oh, you're an answer Blue Cross, right? Yeah. Oh, yes, Blue Cross. Yes, I am. Is that a problem, ma'am? <laughs> Because I need a PR and I don't know what the fuck's going on in this fucking fucking fucked up society. No. We don't take it as a blue cross. What do you mean you don't take it as a blue cross? You freaking transferred my thing. CVS, every article said CVS Pharmacy won't have pound bags out Sacramento Leader Pharmacy. You know, and it's like, no, you don't remember, but it doesn't matter because you won't take my insurance anyway, so you'll have to charge full fucking price! <laughs> yeah, it's only like, you know, $100 a bottle is some shit, you know, and I know a big deal, right? And she's like, well, 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 Fine. That's your problem. You're just a cog in the machine. Like, we're all cogs in this fucked off machine, right, where my insurance can't be transferred, but they can sure stay. Stick it to me, right? You know, okay, fine. It's not your fault. You're a cock. You know, Sally. Sally, I mean. You know, who's your manager? What's the number? You know, this is... Oh, my manager's Juan. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Call back. You know, I got a full head of steam, and this is going on social media for mother fucking sure, right? But all right. So I'm like, okay. So I get a hold of Juan. Hello, this is Juan. You know, and the guy's actually a pretty nice guy, but you know, I'm like, I just reiterated everything I just told you just now, right? You know, like, hi, Juan. Guess what? You're going to have a fun day right now. I got a little story for you, Juan. Here it goes. Da 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 da. No medical, no delivery, nothing for me. And fuck you. I didn't say fuck you. Though. No, I wasn't gonna swear. I was gonna say fuck, 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 fuck. Damn it, fuck. Oh well, fuck. Who the fuck doesn't say fuck on YouTube anymore? Yeah, so fuck it. But no, like, well, 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 I could get, get, give you some options, I would be upset. I go, here's an option. When the person calls me about dick cream, you know, it would be nice for the next person to um actually be told about the fact that their prescription is being transferred and that people on Blue Cross anthem might will not be covered. There will be no delivery. And it would be nice to know before their medications are fucking running out, you stupid fuck! Ah, ah, ah! What did I say like that? I just said, before it happens, he goes, Okay, yeah, we can give you Rayleigh's Bel Air or friggin' 
Safeway or freaking Rite Aid, you know, we have Rite Aid, Rite Aid, Rite Aid, Rite Aid, Rite Aid, Rite Aid, Rite that's right, you know, Rite Aid is the aid, it's right, you know. Oh, really? Really? So, okay, hey, that works for me. All right, anyway, bye, thanks. Ah, bye. <laughs> no, but... Th 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 <laughs> Son of a bitch. My society! I want my future! Now, let me explain what I mean by I want my future. Why, in this age, do we have, where the NSA is probably doing a goddamn fucking better job fucking networking fucking than we are as people, do we have this shit where everybody still has to fill out a form, a paper form, everybody still has to freaking... You know, you can't email anybody. The fax machines are still around. And our social networking society that can Skype and can send freaking working, freaking interrelated, freaking work charts can't seem to make it clear between me, my medical, and two pharmacies that, you know... A seamless transition would probably be something that society should have. Along with universal health care. And a seamless society. A techno society. And we are in the future. We can have all these things. But it is... Shit! It's fucking shit when these fucking little things happen. Because if I hadn't just happened to friggin' had a dick cream problem, you know, it might have been a little worse for me. Like if I was down to friggin' half a thing of friggin' insulin and I hadn't lined up a ride and I didn't have the money ready. And yada, 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 yada. Now it was just, it was really a nothing thing, in a way. You know, except in my own manic mind. But man, it's just like, it's like a side blast, you know. Oosh. What the fuck? What the fuck, right, right? Okay, maybe I'm manic or something, and you know, with my hair disheveled and my freaking... And just going kooky kook do on the freaking, you know, on the goddamn fucking internets, the interwebs. You gotta tell me something. We could have YouTube, but we can't, and it's just like fucking Star Trek, you know, when people are fucking talking to the fucking monitors, you know, that we had in 1967, but fucking we're still here, and it still fucks up. And this woman's talking to me about dick cream, you know, because I got some rash. And, you know, and they're dropping bombs on me. So fuck them. I'll go to Rayleigh's. You know, but they'll probably find some way to fuck it up, too. So, you know, maybe not. I hope not. This is why little businesses don't stay in business. Big businesses don't give a shit. Shit. You know? CVS Pharmacy, you suck. Uh, although you, your staff was pretty nice. I have to admit, you know, so good to that. Let me know in the comments. Here's one. Having fun. Bye!